Dr. Sarah. Now, I'm a cosmetic physician and I work here in Australia. And I'm going to talk to you today a little bit about dry winter skin because it's winter here in Australia. Dry skin is something that lots of people are struggling with. I'm seeing it a lot in the clinic. And I really think that it's an important thing to understand, figure out why you might be having dry skin and what you can do about it. So let's get started. So I'm here in my treatment room. Um, I thought it'd be really good to go through some of the signs of an impaired skin barrier because I see a lot of people come in with dry, compromised skin, especially over winter. So if you have a dry skin type or if you have a compromised skin barrier, what usually tends to happen is, like we've said, those oils get lost from your skin barrier. Your skin barrier is therefore no longer waterproof or sealed or functioning correctly. So you lose moisture through your skin barrier. So you can get things like dryness, flakiness, um, the skin can look rough, texture can be affected so your skin can actually feel rough to the touch. Um, <clears throat> you can also look more red, more irritated and your skin can be more sensitized as your skin barrier is less tolerant of all of the environmental things that you're exposed to on a daily basis. So, um, you know, some of the other things that people really struggle with, and especially over winter, are flares of inflammatory skin conditions or skin barrier conditions, things like eczema, psoriasis, and acne. So winter is a time where our skin needs a little bit more TLC, and if you know the signs to look out for of a compromised skin barrier, then you can actually start to do some things in your routine and also within clinic treatments that are really gonna help you to maximize your skin and make it feel a whole lot better. Okay, so here's some of my favorites. Now, ingredients. And I think over winter with dry skin, we all automatically think of moisturizing. Um, so I've got mainly moisturizers here, but I do have some cleansers that are really beautiful products that really help nourish your skin, but also clean it over winter, which is just as important. Um, so the Dr. Spiller Aloe Sensitive Cleansing Milk is really gentle. It's got aloe vera in it, and it's a really beautiful product for dry and sensitive skin types. So it's really amazing to use this. You can use it all year round if you have some of those uh, skin types. Or over winter, if you want to switch up your routine and just use something a little bit more gentle, if you tend to get a bit more red and sensitized over winter, then this is a really great way to clean your skin. Um, the other option that's a cream cleanser that again is really gentle, hydrating, but also really thoroughly cleansing is the Is Clinical Cream Cleanser. This is one of my favorite cleansers. I actually use it um, in conjunction with their other cleanser called the Cleansing Complex, which I actually don't have up here. So that Cleansing Complex is um, a little bit more resurfacing. It's a little bit more deep cleaning, um, but the cream cleanser is much more gentle. It's a really lovely creamy consistency. Um, and doesn't strip your skin barrier, neither of these products do, um, but really gets your skin nice and clean. So now we're on to moisturizers, and this is the bit of the video that you guys have probably been waiting for. Um, dry skin, moisturizers, they kind of go hand in hand. Uh, and for me, look, they are the most important part of a dry skincare routine, and over winter, you wanna be using them um, as you know, part of the main part of your routine to address that dryness. So some of my favorite ingredients include hyaluronic acid and Profilo is um, it, it's basically a version of hyaluronic acid that you can do as an injectable treatment, but this is a version of that in a cream and it's a really beautiful lightweight formula. It works really nicely under thicker moisturizers, more kind of heavy moisturizers that I like to layer this underneath at night. I'll put this on after my skincare routine and then I'll put a thicker moisturizer on over the top if I feel like my skin needs some extra hydration. But this is a really lovely product. It's, um, it's very lightweight, very hydrating, um, and works really well in, as an adjunct as other parts of your routine. So Is Clinical also has some really amazing moisturizers that you can incorporate into your routine. And you, I use this one all year round, Reparative Moisture Emulsion. It's anti-aging. It actually is getting your skin to repair itself. It's a really amazing moisturizer and it feels beautiful on the skin. It's not too heavy, but it feels very nourishing and hydrating. Now the other thing, uh, the other moisturizer that I use a lot, and I use it a lot for post-treatment because it seals the skin barrier, but it's not too occlusive. Um, and it actually helps the skin to repair itself. It helps the skin to heal faster. And that's called the Shield Recovery Balm. And I also incorporate this as um, a nighttime treatment, sort of a leave-on treatment that I put on after my nighttime, uh, my evening skincare routine. 
and it really helps to keep your skin hydrated over winter. You can also use this on areas where you get more dry skin, so the knees, the elbows, dry scaly patches. It's, yeah, it's, it's a really great um, moisture-rich formula. And again, this has all of those kind of ceramides, fatty acids, those lipids in there, but it delivers it to the skin in a non-greasy, not too heavy way. So I really like this moisturizer. So again, from the Dr. Spiller range, we've got these moisturizers. Now, what I really love about Dr. Spiller is that they are really respective of your lipid barrier. So all of their products are actually formulated in a way that helps your skin barrier to repair itself. And they contain lots of lipids that really help to moisturize your skin barrier, help it to repair itself. So the Sanvita cream is great if you've got redness, if you've kind of got that type of skin that's a little bit more reactive, but it's super hydrating. And then the collagen cream is good for just sort of more normal skin types who might need that extra bit of hydration over winter. They're both really lovely products, great moisturizers, um, and they are really super hydrating for your skin. Now the other one that I don't actually have here to show you is called the Rinazel cream, uh, Rinazel lacteal um, cream. It's great after treatments that you have in the clinic. It's perfect for sort of slightly more mature skins that want a, a bit more of an anti-aging focus, but also focus on redness, on dehydration. So that is a really amazing product. It's very repairing and very hydrating for the skin. So from the Dr. Spiller range, they're definitely my top picks. Finally, we've got a more affordable, more accessible, like kind of drugstore option for hydrating your skin over winter. Now, CeraVe is developed with dermatologists. They have put a lot of research into these new winter skin focused products. So um, the moisturizing cream is obviously for very to very, very dry skin. It's a thicker formulation. They also have this as a lotion as well. I really love this for my face and for my body, I put this on after the shower. It's a really great way to help combat dry winter skin on your body as well. Um, it's got three essential ceramides in here. It's also got hyaluronic acid in here. And the technology that they've put into this means that the hydration is uh, released slowly throughout the course of the day. So you apply this in the morning after your shower, your skin's gonna stay hydrated all day. So I really love this product. Um, and it's a really great affordable option that you can find everywhere. Chemist Warehouse has it, has it um, and yeah, it's a really great one, staple uh, to have at home, have in your routine. You can use it for all skin types. So yeah, this is a great option. Thanks for joining me at the clinic, guys. These are some of my favorite products for winter skin, and you can use them for dry skin types all year round. It's all about hydration and your skin barrier over winter, and these are my hero products that really deliver in these areas. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. I can't wait to see you guys in the next video, but that's me up for today.